Traditional candy bars are notoriously high in sugar and with this chocolate pumpkin bar recipe, I wanted to make sure it's healthy, tasty and low in sugar. This recipe uses awesome ingredients and it is also nutritious, high in antioxidants without sacrificing its taste. To make this recipe, in a blender, add 200 grams of pumpkin seeds, 50 grams of pitted date, but before you use your date, you can actually soak it in hot water for 10 minutes, and also add one scoop of whey protein powder of your choice. Blend for one minute in your blender, and then add 100 grams of peanut butter. Once blended, pour the dough into an oven pan so you can get it into shape like I'm doing. To give this recipe the extra crunchy texture, I added 50 grams of walnut. Make sure you don't blend the walnut, you just want to pulse it in your blender so it retains its crunchy texture. Pulse it for just a few seconds. Then add it on top of the dough and spread evenly. Lastly, for the chocolate, I used 100 grams of dark chocolate because it is high in antioxidant and actually healthy for you if you eat it in moderation. So melt your chocolate and then pour it evenly on top of the dough. Let the dough sit for one hour before you cut it into small sizes the way you like it. I cut mine into sizes of 32 grams to 48 grams. Check the description below for the macronutrient breakdown of this recipe. Guys, as you've seen, this chocolate pumpkin bars is easy to make and can be enjoyed as a low calorie snack through the week. It's also great because it is high in protein and low in carbohydrates, especially low in sugar. Just make sure after making this recipe, store it in an airtight container like a kiwana jar and eat it within 7 days. If you like this recipe, please like this video and subscribe for more fitness food recipes like this. I really really appreciate your support. Thank you for watching.